Hi there, I am Giuseppe Corcella from Virtual Orchestration and today I'm going to review Soprano Textures by Emergence Audio. First of all, I want to thank Emergence Audio for kindly sending us a copy of the library to review. Soprano Textures is a library for soundscapes, textures, indeed effects and cinematic purposes. It features the soprano Arwen Fronzen recorded in six vowels. It usually sells for $49 and the size is 173 megabytes installed. It works in the free version of Contact and it's NKS compatible. Downloads via native access. It comes with two main NKI instruments called INIT. In the second one, the mod wheel controls the vibrato. Then you have three presets folders correlated where the two sound sources are treated in a way that make them like they were in two different places. Infinite pads, presets with a more experimental approach and pulses, presets that create a kind of pulsing sound using the engine's LFO. You can find them also as snapshots inside the init soprano textures patch. These are based on the Emergence Audio's very own Infinite Motion engine. As you can see it's a two layers engine and you can choose between different sound sources for layer A and layer B and also turn on and off one of the two removing samples from the RAM. The two layers have quite a few effects you can use to customize your own sound and these parameters are similar to both of them. And you can also link some of them between the two layers. You have an ADSR here, high pass, low pass filters and you can work on cutoff, resonance and pen. Expression controls the volume. This is the LFO which in my opinion is the core of the engine. You can set the rate, the depth and the type of wave. But the peculiarity of this engine is that you have a smaller oscillator assigned to almost each parameter. These little oscillators respond to the main one and you can set how they work on a specific parameter. So you can really create an evolving sound here. You activate the oscillators by clicking on these small circles. The big knob controls the mix of the two layers. 100% left you'll hear only layer 1, 100% right you will hear only layer 2. These two faders control the volumes for layer 1 and 2 and the small knobs below them control the tuning. You can also randomize all the parameters and I believe this is a very useful feature in experimental libraries like this. On the second page you can add some effects such as convolution reverb, delay, chorus, rotator, distortion and even here you can activate the oscillator on some parameters to have uh, some ongoing variations. Finally, you have some multis here.
Well, my opinion about the Emergence Audio's libraries stands still at very high levels. Those libraries are pure gems and Soprano Textures is not less worthy. This one has mainly a very ethereal fantasy mystic vibe, a pure cinematic sound, but not only. You can use it on every genre you want, it works just fine for pads, drones, to create atmospheres, the quality of the samples is great and the Emergence Audio's engine lets you fully customize your sound. So if you are looking for a kind of textural library with a sort of ethereal vibe and a very customizable sound, I really suggest you to check this out. It's all for today, I hope you enjoyed this video, if you want to support virtual orchestration, subscribe to the channel, join our new site if you wish, hit the like button, don't forget to click on the bell icon to get notified as soon as we are releasing a new tutorial or a new review. If you are new to the world of virtual orchestration and you wish to learn more about it, or even if you are a pro or semi-pro looking to improve your skills, we offer private online lessons about virtual orchestration, mock-up, programming and how to use Doric Sibelius, Cubase and Logic Pro. Get in touch at info at I wish you a wonderful day and see you on the next review.